How's it going, everybody? Ragroth here. Uh, so it looks like we actually got a more of a gameplay trailer for Aftermath from Mortal Kombat 11. Uh, we got like more of a story-focused one last week. We only saw a little bit of gameplay of Fujin and Shiva, and actually none of Robocop. So I think now it's all about the gameplay of these characters. I'm, I'm definitely hyped. Let's chuck it out. Okay, we're getting Shiva first, I guess. Or both? Sounds awesome. <laughs> Deadpool looks so good too. Oh my god. He's got like a slide. Oh, that's Frost's classic. Whoa! Whoa! It's a neat outfit for Fujin. That's a different outfit for Shiva. I think it's made a classic. The future of law enforcement. <laughs> okay, here's some Robocop. Okay, so he's got the shield. Nice, I love that gun. Oh, he's got the anti-air. Got the anti-tank. Oh. He's got rockets like Sector. Here's his fatal blow. Ooh. Nice, he's got the data spike. Whoa, who can like walk on air? Right, he's got the knee. I like that outfit for Shiva. That's cool. Got after that. Let's stomp. Ooh. I like that outfit for Fujin. I just don't like him with shorter hair. I don't know, it kind of looks cool, but I don't know. Oh my god, I have Verbal Cop versus Terminator. Oh, he's got like a stun? I don't remember them. Here, fatal blow. We saw all over that. Oh, I like how she shoots the fire. That's kind of neat. I was hoping she'd do something like that. Oh, he does a little bit of the jetpack. I think. I think. Is the shield just? Oh, he's got the flamethrower. Nice. It's like sector. Ooh, that was nice. More of a Shang Tsung move. Oh, nice. There's the crossbow. Oh, is this the... Oh, my God. <laughs> Ooh. Skin off. Oh, that 209. <laughs> I figured. Oh. oh. Okay, so other stages do have a stage with that. That's good. Nice. I'll show them both their fatalities, I think. Ooh. Not bad. Awesome. All right. Yeah, those costumes are great. All right, let's watch it again. Watch it again. I'm definitely more okay, but a little more okay with Shiva after this. A little bit more. Say in incompetence or incompetence. <laughs> My only thing is, ah, Fujin looks fantastic. I do like that. I, I just wish that. I don't know. I do like the short hair. That's sick. I do wish he used the crossbow a little bit more, but maybe they're like. I mean, you know, trailers don't always show every move. Robocop looks great. 
I just want to know if he has the reboot skin. That's all I want to know. <laughs> he doesn't seem like... I mean, he does seem like a long-range character, but he still seems like he has some close-range stuff. <laughs> That's so cool. He can, like, walk on air. He looks like Virgil, though. I do like it. I don't know. What are his skeleton will look like? He'll have one. Yeah, I do. I do like how she does the fireball. So that's kind of nice. Actually, wait, is that a different skin? Can't tell. It looked like he had like battle damage or something. That's so sick. I didn't expect this stage to have a stage fatality. That's funny though. He's got it. I figured M209 would be in something. Kind of like the Alien Queen for Alien and MKX. great. I mean, you know, like you know, like I said, as someone that wasn't really excited for Shiva, I'm a little more excited after this. Um, Rob can I see more gameplay? Well, gameplay of Robocop. He looks really awesome. Uh, definitely a lot of stuff in movies. I actually watched the first three movies um, this past week. Fujin looks fantastic. Um, I guess my only nitpicks is I do hope he uses the crossbow more. You know, like I said, sometimes the trailers don't show all the moves they can do. I do think he uses his sword a little too much. Um, but, I mean, it's not that, it's not that big a deal. And, you know, obviously, obviously it's not, you know, I don't want to make it sound like I'm, I'm looking to gift horse in the mouth here. Um, I mean, but he looks, still looks amazing, and they've done stuff with him that I don't really think anyone had really thought of doing with him. Like, they're running on air, and it looks like you think he does have the knee, and, um, his fatality from what we saw looks pretty cool. Um, I guess that we only... Yeah, it's weird because we only saw one of his fatalities, but I think we've seen a glimpse of both Shiva and Robocop, so I wonder why that is. And yeah, yeah the new stages look great. I, I also apologize for the last reaction video. If I didn't really talk much about, like, the story and the stages and stuff, I think I was just so, like... I think I was just so focused on food and I kind of forgot to react to some other stuff. The new stages are great. Um, I don't know if Soul Chamber would be my number one classic pick, but I actually think they made it look really cool in this game, even if, even if it does look a bit like Shinnok's Bone Temple. I think that's kind of why I didn't really comment on it because it looked very similar, and I, it kind of didn't stand out until I, you know, yeah, I actually looked and noticed it. And other people pointed it out. Uh, Chronos, Chronicus Keep looks cool. I feel like I haven't seen that much of that. Stage fatalities being back are great, and I'm glad it's not going to be just in the the new stages. Um, it's great, obviously, to doing more story, especially because I think this story will actually focus on characters that I actually like to play as, or at least more than a lot of the characters you play as in the story. I'm hoping Fujin gets a chapter. Um, I do like that other outfit for Fujin. I'm really mixed on him not having long hair in the outfit. The hair he has is cool. It's just weird not having him a long hair. Um, especially because it would be... Hopefully there's a version of that where he does have long hair. That's all I can say there. Um, maybe it's... It could be a gear option, I guess, for all we know. I don't know. But, um... You know, they look great. Um, I do want to see more Robocop skins. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to May 26th. I do have to say, I don't think I said it before, uh, thank you, NetherRealm, for finally bringing back Fujin. 
Thank you for finally, you know, I know we bust balls, I know we're critical. Thank you for finally bringing him back, he looks great. Thank you for putting the story on him. You know, we'll, I guess we'll see what we say more about that when it comes out. Um, all I can really ask is that maybe you can at least keep him around a little bit longer now. It does seem like he is being really well received from what I've seen. Hopefully this isn't the end, but I guess this is a good note to go out on if it is. Um, and I also do want to apologize for not uploading. I know I've been trying to upload more and I haven't really uploaded that much this like after after last week, I mean, after last Wednesday. Um, I haven't been feeling that great. Um, I, I, recording this is a little easier. And, um, you know, I am trying to work on, like, my Fujin celebration videos as well, so that's taking some time as well. So I apologize I'm not uploading this frequently. I'm hoping I'll feel a little better and, and get back more on the schedule I was trying to do. Um, but thank you so much for checking out this video. Let me know what you guys think about this all. List in the comments below what your favorite part about it was. Like the video if you like it, dislike it, dislike it. It's a free country. Uh, and as I always say, in the time or the place, keep being awesome. And welcome back, Fujin.